Hi everyone, this is Jason at SportsBoxBreaks.com coming to you live on 12-4-2023. I'm doing our 2023 Panini Mosaic Mega Blaster Football 17 Box Mixer number one. Uh, it'll contain 10 purple blasters, 4 purple megas, and 3 green megas. Hits will be any numbered cards autos, of course. These 10 came out of a sealed case, so the second box or second break of this will be uh, 10 boxes also. <clears throat> So, in this one, we're looking for the red parallels. Okay, so the red uh, parallel blaster exclusives. Who's got who in the break? Uh, Arizona is T. Greg Z with the Falcons and the Ravens. Cole D with the Bills. Greg Z with the Panthers. Mark B with the Bears. Brian S has the Bengals. Chris L has the Browns. We got Greg Z with the Cowboys. Joe W with the Broncos. And Kevin R with the Lions. Greg Z has the Packers. Jared P. with the Texans and the Colts. Uh, <clears throat> Tony K. has the Jags. David F. has the Chiefs. We got T. with the Raiders. Tony K. with the Chargers. Eric T. with the Rams. Cole D. Uh, Cole D. with the Dolphins. Joe W. with the Vikings. Greg Z. with the Patriots. Brian S. has the Saints. Chris L. has the Giants. Tom K. has the Jets. Um, the Eagles is... Greg Z, Matthew VDG with the Steelers, Greg Z with the 49ers and Seahawks, Eric T has the Buccaneers, Eric T has the Commanders, and Jared P has the Titans. All right, here we go. So we'll do five blasters at a time. Again, there's a second half of this, guys. And lots of football, 40% off, SBB 40 off on all football and basketball right now on the site. All team breaks of football and basketball. I'm not going to say anything. I'll just sit here with my roll tide and just move on. Listen, I understand, I get it, but money talks. Also, the 54th strength of schedule. And I'm tired of people saying if you go undefeated, you just got to beat who you got to beat who's in front of you, then Liberty should be in. You're going to go with that, and don't give me Power 5 garbage, because you're telling me Liberty couldn't beat Syracuse? Or Wake? Just saying. When you knew you were in trouble there, Joe, when your big wins on ESPN's rankings things were Louisville and LSU, both with three losses, and one just lost to a team that Alabama blew out. Because if you picked before the beginning of the season, USC would have been in. Notre Dame would have been in. If it's four best teams, then I think they got it right, with, it, with the exception of Georgia. I think Georgia should be in over somebody else, too, but I'm not going to go there. It'll all be taken care of next year. When we're bored out of our minds watching the first round of a playoff game. Not all undefeateds are the same. Let's just put it that way. Just look at division, every division under.
FSU's just got to get their lawsuit going and get out of the ACC. Because Stanford and Cal aren't helping you in football. You'll have a hell of a volleyball and gymnastics, though. Ooh, there's an orange. Yeah, but at that point, are you really arguing 13? You know what I mean? Who was 13 this year? I mean, I don't know. Is Bo Nix going to play? If Bo Nix is going to play, Liberty's just going to get blown out of the water. All right, here we go. We should get a couple autos, hopefully, out of the blasters, because these are out of a sealed case. They're not just random blasters. All right, let's find the exclusive reds. And any numbered cards will count as... So the exclusives and the numbered cards. Everything else will ship. Also. But those are what are going to be the hits, and the autos, of course, and any relics or anything. All right, here we go. All right, Miles Murphy. That's just the green. Another green here. Touchdown Master, Stefan Diggs. Trevor Lawrence green. Looking for autos. Here we go. Exclusive red. Thunder Lane, Joe Mixon. So Joe Mixon, Thunder Lane. Exclusive red. Cincinnati, Brian S. Brian S. Quentin Johnson. What a waste of a pick there. All right, Jalen Ramsey, kid reporter. Hendon Hooker there. All right. Blaster one done. Blaster two. Hunter Renfro, green, green, Fred Warner, bang, DJ Moore, green, Brees Hall, there goes our red, it looks like the red's at the bottom every time, there's a green Tyler Scott, and our red is a bang, Levante David for the Buccaneers. So the Buccaneers under my Buccan hat. Eric T getting that one. All right, two down. Number three on its way. Huh, same card on top. Ramondre Stevenson, same card. H stack on top. All right, we got a green Kelly Ringo. NFL debut of Will Levis. Derrick Henry, Roll Tide Green. There's our red. Luke Kinkley, Darren Sproles, Thunder Lane. Eric Dickerson, Green. And how about a red? Aaron Jones for the pack. Aaron Jones for the pack. Red exclusive. Green Bay, Greg Z. All right, here's a cut right at the orange. So we'll see what's going on there. 
Eddie George Green. Jonathan Taylor Green. Here's our orange, Cole Komet. That is the 25. Cole Komet for the Bears. Chicago, Mark B. Getting that one. Congrats there, Mark. Mike Williams. Comes another green here. Darren James. And how about Mike Allstott? Mike Allstott, red. Tampa Bay again, Eric T. All right, let me put these away. All right. Herman Moore, green. There's a Will Anderson roll tide. Josh Jacobs Green, Timmy Tebow Green, Cam Akers, Mosaic, Green Cam Smith, and how about a Thunder Lane, David Montgomery for the Lions. Lions, Detroit, Kevin R. getting that one. All right, here we go. I just like what's his, uh, Travis's uh, quote. I wish I broke my leg earlier so they could see what team we are. If he breaks his leg earlier, they're not in this position. Like, it's just not, you're not beating Clemson, you're not beating Duke, you're not, I don't know. And why is he in against Northern Alabama? Play a series and whatever, and your backup should have been able to take care of that. It was the same when Jalen Milrow got injured a little bit in the Chattanooga game. What, what is he doing in there? Yeah, we do. Yeah, you do. Look at how much, how many points he accounted for this year. And then look at your offense when he was out. It's not an opinion if you look at the stats. That was uh, an awful game to watch. Saturday night. Both those games were terrible. The amount of offense he accounted for and the amount that dipped off after he disappeared, and not disappeared, but didn't couldn't play anymore, is fantastic. Your defense looked fine, but so does Iowa's. Iowa held Michigan to 23 points. Like, I'm not saying it because I'm a Bama fan. I'm saying it because of stats. Your league let you down. Clemson let you down. Duke not finishing well let you down. North Carolina 
losing on the way out. Let you down. Your strength of schedule didn't work out. I understand that, but Michigan has their starting quarterback, has beaten Ohio State, has beaten Penn State. They had a soft schedule too, but they have two signature wins against teams that are in the top whatever, 10. I'm telling you, when your top wins are Louisville and LSU, there's a problem there. I said, you could go back and look at my Facebook. I said Alabama should have been fifth. I called it Saturday night after Florida State win. After the Florida State win, I said Alabama's going to be number five. Because I thought, no way, they're going to do it. But, if you're going to argue it, there it is. Liberty's 13-0. and I'm tired of hearing the 13-0. and Liberty's 13-0. and Tulane would have been third, well would have had their loss in their their conference game, but if their starting quarterback played, they would have had a win against Ole Miss. Like I don't know. Aaron Jones, look at like I said, if you look at the under divisions and the teams that go undefeated and get into the playoff and get blown out of the water, your conference makes you what you are. And what your record is. My my alma mater was undefeated and got beat by a team, I think, with two losses in the first round. Something like that. Ooh, here's one. Elevate Red. That one looks sweet. Elevate Red. Trevor Lawrence. Nice. Tony K. Yeah, exactly. Ask TCU. Louisville was ranked 14 for what reason, though? Same reason Iowa was ranked 18. If you want to play that game, we could we could really go that game too. Louisville was ranked that high to give Florida State some credibility. Iowa was ranked so high to give Florida or to give Michigan some credibility. Just in case something wacky happened. Do I think they should have been in? Yes. Can I see why they're not in? Absolutely. Do I think Alabama should have been out? Sure. Stefan Diggs. Buffalo. Next one up. All right, red coming. Here it comes. It is. Ooh, how about a Mahomes? Touchdown Masters. Nice. The red with the Chiefs red. It was one of the least watched national championship games. Because they knew the outcome. Because they knew that that fluff record of TCU's wasn't really a record. I...
There was never a doubt that Georgia was going to lose that game. Next year, you won't have to worry about it. Next year, you could go 10-2 and and you'll probably get in. Gold? Ooh, we do. What is this? Razzle Dazzle Jake Hayner. I've never seen that one yet. I'm going to put that in a sleeve here. Razzle Dazzle. It's got to be like a case hit or something. Because I have not seen one of these. Jake Hayner, Saints. Brian S. And then the red, Thunder Lane. Travis Etienne, Jacksonville, doing good. Tony K. And the Jags. That's the only reason they're going to a 12 team playoff, is because of the money. Financially traveling all over the place, it's actually going to lose money. But the money you're going to make back at advertising and everything else, ticket sales and all of that, it's going to be ridiculous. Jacorian Bennett. I really, and I, and you know it's for money because they didn't follow the other divisions criteria where every conference winner gets a chance and then you have some at-larges. They don't want that. They're going to let one little conference winner in, and then every other is going to be the bigger teams. Tony Pollard. So that right there tells you it's money. Why shouldn't Miami, Ohio have a chance? Detroit. Or sorry, Dallas. Tony Pollard, which is Greg Z. Like, Conference USA should have a shot at it. Not just if they're the highest whatever. But it's never going to happen. Conference USA added Delaware. Which is pretty cool. Delaware stepping up now. Alright, so there goes the three boxes of... Or ten boxes of blasters. Here comes the three green mega. These are the retail megas. So retail exclusive mega auto scripts. And uh, ten... We're looking for the reactive blue in here. Reactive blue out of these three. Now, these aren't out of a case. The three and the six aren't out of a case. These three I actually picked up. They might actually be out of a case. I picked up in a trade with someone at a show for Pokemon stuff that we couldn't move. And he could move. He wanted the Pokemon stuff, and he traded for the Pokemon for six boxes of this. I think the BCS was more correct. <clears throat> Imagine if it was the BCS now. It would still be Michigan and Washington. I think that's what they said the math is. Forget it. I looked at it two days ago. Someone had it posted. All right, let's find the blue in here. Try to find an auto. I'd have no problem with it at all either. But then you can't complain with what Michigan did and only played three hard teams. Scheduled, you know, everybody out of conference. I don't know. gonna be interesting next year i love college football just for this i am I, i'll watch pro football but college football is just so much more i get more excited on saturday i could sit down in front of the tv from you know 9 a.m until one o'clock in the morning nfl anymore if i catch an hour of it it's fine 
just boring. I don't know. My opinion. Oh, Mike Leach is, was awesome, man. His rants on everything. All right, here we go. The three greens. Looking for a blue. The blue parallel. Ooh, was, do we have gold coming, maybe? All right, there's a Bryce Young rookie. There's a blue. William Fahoko. And another one, Veda Vea. All right, so we're going to get a lot of blue in the mega boxes, it looks like. Okay. So let's sleeve these up. Cowboys. Tampa. That's not gold. DJ Moore. Josh Downs. Evan Ingram. Eli. Drew Sanders and Juju Smith-Schuster. Uh, is this the... No, nope, that's just the bang. Shaquille Leonard. And then we have Billy White Shoes Johnson and Sean Alexander. Roll tight on the Sean Alexander. Okay. No auto yet, huh? Brian Brees and Mike Evans. Oh, come on, fingers. There you are. Gronk. Aaron Rodgers, and how about, nice, a C.J. Stroud. C.J. Stroud debut. Blue, very nice. Going to Houston. Jackson Smith and Jigba and Lawrence Taylor. Andre Reed and Steve Young. Darren James. Aaron James showing up. All right. Box three of the green. Keyshawn and Clinton Portis. Marvin Mims and Heinz Ward. That was going to be like the uh, blasters, like one blue. That's all right. Let's get them. Better for you. Ty Law. How about one auto out of one of these? Dan Hampton and Jerry Rice. Broderick Jones and Darren Waller. Dwight Stevenson. Okay. 
We got four boxes of purple coming up. These are the mega boxes, purple ones. Harder to get. Looking for the camo red, I think they are. Yeah, right, camo red. Can do anything else tonight, guys. Just mosaic red. So these are camo red versus mosaic red. These mosaics love to move. Again, another one of these set up on the site, guys. guarantee there's an auto then I'm gonna show up in that next not guarantee but I can almost count on it because the 10 blasters came out of a case and you usually get a couple autos out of a case of blasters whether it's baseball football or basketball guys 40% off ball basketball and football we need it to start moving One more here. All right, here we go. 
Good luck. Let's see what red camos we get here. All right, the red camo coming out first. Darius Slay Jr. Those are cool looking. Red camos are pretty cool. So there's a Darius Slay Jr. You know what? What I'll do is, yeah, here's what I'll do. Come on, let's get one of the big names. If we're not going to get an auto. Kyler, Murray, and Devin White. So I'll get them out, and then I'll sleeve them up. Tank Bigsby and Jimmy G. Jimmy Garoppolo. There's a Jamari Gibbs. Roll Tide. Derek Carr. There's a Jamar Chase. Mac Jones, Roll Tide. Get out uh, from Belichick and you'll be fine. Brian Branch, DK Metcalf. How about him learning sign language just so he doesn't get flagged? It'll only be, you know, next week or two weeks from now, they'll have something where he can get flagged for it. You start to realize more and more it was more Tom Brady than it was Bill Belichick. Which is just crazy. All right, here we go. Randall Cunningham and Tavarius Robinson, rookie. Tavarius. I love these with their giant head. There's a Will Anderson mosaic. Joe Theismann. Keyshawn and Demar 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 Demarvian. There we go. Overshone. Randy Moss. Darren James, Jake Campbell, Dan Hampton, and Derrick Henry, Roll Tide. All right, sleeve these puppies up. Beautiful. All right. Box three. Still looking for our first auto. All right. We got Max Crosby. Yeah, that Razzle Dazzle has to be because I haven't seen any of those. Jalen Waddle. Sam Howell and Dallas Clark. All the other inserts I've seen. There's a C.J. Stroud rookie. C.D. Lamb and Zach uh, Carbonet. You know, a hat when you used to have, you know, in the early 1900 Model T's. So it's a Carbonet, a.k.a. a hood. Or trunk? Don't what the British call a bonnet? Uh, trunk? Or that's a boot. Yeah, whatever. Don't mind me. Alright. Bonnet's a hood. Boot is the trunk.
His parents are mean? Oh. I'm slow, I'm telling you. Slow tonight. Alright, can we end on a boom here? Here we go. Cooper Cup. Shannon Sharp and Brock Purdy. Nice Brock Purdy. Peter Skoronsky. Kelsey. Mark Andrews and Justin Jefferson. I think the second break is going to be pure fire. We got Paul Kraus. Chamari Connor. And Najee Harris. Roll Tide. Alright guys, that'll do it. All of these will ship. Your hits will be encased, and if you didn't get a hit, you'll get a hobby pack of cards. Let me just show on camera that I am sleeving these up, even though the hit recap will show it. I just don't want anybody complaining. Alright guys, thanks for filling it up, and I'll get it shipped out in the next shipping batch.